This is Chris Kelly with your Peak Fitness Posture Fix of the Week. Now one of the things that we think about when we're getting up and active, really in this first part of the year, is just doing things like stretching, mobilization, and uh, you know mobility circuits to help to kind of get the muscles moving and active uh, after our latent holiday period. One of the things that goes along with this feeling of stiffness that we have after we've been sitting down is simply getting the joints to move better. Um, while we think about stretching our muscles, because our joints glide across one another, when they're stuck together just from sitting down, from kind of compressing them by, you know, either standing where gravity's pressing down, pressing them together, or sitting down in prolonged periods of time, you know, we feel this stiffness when we're walking around. And one of the things that we can do to alleviate this, along with stretching, is a technique known as distraction. All right, with distraction, um, what we're doing here is literally using gravity to pull the leg apart. So whereas, say I've stood on this leg for you know, six hours, what I can do is stand on the other leg, let this hang off of a step, and gravity is working in the opposite fashion. So now it's pulling the leg apart. What I've got here is an ankle weight around my ankle here. But you can use anything from like a heavy shoe to just anything that you can use to weight your leg down. And you know, along with stretching, you know, maybe apply a stretch for a minute or two, do your foam rolling, and then we would do what is called a uh, just a distraction mobilization where I'm standing on a on a, um, a bench here, I'm just letting my leg hang down, I'm just feeling gravity pulling my joints apart. All right? I'm, what, you, what we do at the same time is just move gently through the range of motion, you know, just forward, <coughs> some circles with the leg, in and out, this way counterclockwise, side to side, and really just, you know, in, in just various motions to just help to get that joint moving through the range of motion while we're pulling them apart. Because we are pulling them apart, we're getting a little bit better range of motion here. It's really a great way to just uh, give these joints some breathing room and uh, something to undo that desk posture throughout the day. Now for our upper body, what we've got is what is called a band mobilization, okay? With this, what I'm doing is I've just looped a, a band around a pole here. Um, you can loop a, comp, a band around maybe a table leg, something like that. But what you do is you just back up. So you're getting a good stretch here uh, in the shoulder joint. And the same rules apply. You can just move it through the range of motion. I'm just internally, externally rotating my arm here. You can move them forward and back. And you can back up to increase the effect. I'm feeling this all along my lateral stretches here. I'm getting a good stretch of you know my lats and kind of my outer back muscles as well. but more importantly, I'm just moving through the range of motion, kind of mobilizing the shoulder joints. Uh, the second position for this would be overhead. Right? So I'm just walking backwards here. I'm getting this over my head. And for somebody that has limited motion over the shoulder, this is a great way to just kind of mobilize this joint, get things moving around. You know, just holding this for about a minute or two in a similar manner to you, how you would do a stretch. Um, you know, in summary, I would group these together. I would do, you know, uh, a stretch, various stretches for the hip, then maybe distraction for a minute, various stretches for the upper body, abstraction for the minute, for a minute or so. And really, this is going to help to directly alleviate stiffness and complement your stretching and your foam rolling work. And that is your postural tip of the week.